Hello everyone. Welcome back to Deus Ex Human Revolution. We're going to hack our terminal. Oh yes we can. <laughs> Security rating too low? Really? You've got to be kidding me. Uh, uh, inventory. Where are my hacking pads? There we go. Use equip. G. There we go. Why is everything in black and white here? That's annoying. Tier 5 as well. Yep, G. Okay. Interesting. Okay, that's weird. Credit chip. Wow, that's a lot of credits. Okay. Um, I'm not sure where everything here is black and white. Can we go through here? That's where we were. Oh, wow. This this looks odd. This really looks odd. Okay, we are going to clear a path. We found our girlfriend. Who has been cheating on our Jensen, DNA. what the hell's going on out there? Broadcast frequencies are going haywire. Malik, is that you? Where are you? Coming into visual range of Singapore now. Been in the air since Pritchard first pinged you. Oh, my God. I'm heading for a hangar bay to open the roof. I'll need an emergency extraction. Roger that. Please I'm tell me she's way. got a chip. Please tell me she does have the chip. Well, at least everyone there is uh, offline. Hey, Jensen. Looks like you could use some help. <laughs> e -M -P, Renee. I see the scientist, Jensen. I'm landing nearby. And I think Dr. Reed wants to speak to you. Hang on. There they are. <laughs> Don't trip. Just run in. Can I go through this door, please? Hello? Adam? We're all fine, but you have to get to Panchea and stop Hugh. You and I aren't done with this, Megan. I know how it looks, but you have to stop the broadcast. I think it's causing the new biochips to overstimulate the vagus nerve, creating terrifying hallucinations. You mean it's driving augmented people insane? Yes, and it's up to you to stop it. Use the Leo shuttle. It will take you to Panchea. Good luck, Adam. A shuttle? You mean a rocket? Well, that will be fun. Looks like a little like the rocket that the Amazon produced and landed. I guess we're going in it. Automated systems online. Darrow sequence one, code one, one A, preset and ready to engage. Suborbital trajectory plotted. Destination, Panchea. Begin countdown, Mr. Darrow. Uh, no, no, Abort yet. countdown, I'm not ready yet. Countdown, aborted. I want to search these, all these people. And I want to... Oh, there's an explosion there. I want to get the ammo. I want to get the guns. Okay, so we are going to stop the neural transmission. Hopefully. Confirm liftoff to Panchea, Mr. Darrow. Uh, yes. Begin countdown. Code zero zero zero. Confirm zero. Countdown commencing. It's gonna be a hell of a ride. I wonder if this will land by parachute or... Oh, Stand wait up. Stand by for the Electrodynamic launch assist sequence commencing. 3, 2, 1. And go. Oh, Ian. Oh. Oh, 
this is cool. I want, I want such a system at home. Failure? Of course. Well, at least we didn't hit that building. It never goes according to plan, does it? First Malek, now we? Actually, other question. If Malek died... Jensen! Jensen, can you read me? Barely. I've reached Panchea, Pritchard. Any word from Sarah for the UN delegates? Nothing. The installation went into lockdown shortly after Darrow gave his speech. I can't tell if anyone's even alive. And the signal's still broadcasting. Meaning no one's safe till I get in there and shut it down. You'll have to disengage the lockdown first. Look for a master control panel at the top of the tower. Okay, step one. How do we get in? Looks like that bar door is barred. Uh, looks like there's an entrance over there. Feel like this is the entrance. Weapon cabinets, thank you. Combat rifle, gas grenades, more ammo. Hey, I want that one, dang it. Uh, drop the green, no, not the green one. My inventory is too full. There you go, drop that. There we go, okay. Two full clips. Oh. There we go. I wonder if Jess could have gone through the front door, but we'll see. Let's go for stun weapons. Don't want to kill anyone if I don't have to. There are crossbow bolts there. I got a feeling we're going to fight something like ghouls. Oh, there's a robot beneath us. Oh yeah. There's the robot. That thing over there. That's a combat robot. Let's see if we can not activate him. That would be nice. Where's this going? Going up. Who's that? Rocket launcher. Well, you won't need the credits. Well, at least for the way out we know that there is a rocket launcher up here if we need one. Okay, there's a computer over there. I was looking for something, but apparently there's nothing really here. Pritchard, Panchea's broadcast center is at the base of the station near the bottom of the ocean. Is that right? But the lockdown caused all the blast doors to seal. You won't be able to go down until you override them manually. From up in the tower. I got it. So, we need to go through the other side. Well, we can try. I hope the robot will stay offline. Let's see what's true here. Uh, let's see, 25. <laughs> Access granted. Okay, there we go. Robot is online. Oh no, he is just there. Okay. Shotgun. It's grenade launcher ammo. Well, don't need it. 
Where's this going? A lot of rooms, a lot of paths. Looks like this is going under the door. Now we're not there yet, but at least we are on the other side. Ammo, a lot of grenades. I'd like those. Oh, I've got a right for revolver ammo on me, apparently. Let's drop that. We don't need that. Where's the revi revolver ammo? No, we don't have it on this. Oh well, then I don't know. I don't know. A lot of ways here to deal with the robot, but apparently we did not activate it yet, so it doesn't really matter to us. Here, there he is. Still doing nothing. So we need to go up. How do we get up? Let's use these stairs. It's almost one full box. Okay, let's go and upgrade our hacking skill to tier 5. So at least we can hack these terminals as well. Tier 5. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, nuke this one. Nuke this one. And hack this one. Access granted. There we go. Default, disable. Disabled. Okay, now I'm sure it's disabled. Hey, nice guy. How are you doing? Doing fine? Good. Just stay there. There we go, and up we go! Oh, let's please go up as far as we can. How is the map looking? Pretty easy, actually. Just looks like this is going all the way up. Oh, this is a long elevator. We've got some music! Okay, looks like there's one person here. Oh, that person's. Okay, of all these persons, there's one still alive. Yep, we're pretty high up. Oh wow, this is a big facility. Looks like he's trying to go outside and don't know how anymore. Oh wow. This is a big facility. Someone tried to get in there. And there's a way in funny enough. I guess through here. Nope, there's a lot of 
medical supplies here at least. If you need it. Okay, but we need to go up. Nothing over here, okay. This really feels like some kind of ghost town. Feels like a feeling I had with Thief. Access granted. There we go. Woohoo! Almost did not make it. A lot of high post praise. Yeah, this is going all the way to the other side. Right, there was something, so let's just check it out. This should be next to the stairs. No, it isn't. It's the room we could have gone into, and this is the other room with... Oh, wow. Heavy rifle. And a lot of ammo. Hmm. Okay, that is interesting. Can we drop a lot to get the ammo? Well, we can drop the mine templates. Because they don't stack. Uh, we don't have normal mines left. Could make them in a few gas mines, but don't really want to, I think. We have three clips of ammo there. Do we have anything we don't are we are not going to use? Grenade launcher ammo, I guess we're not gonna use. These we are gonna use. Um maybe drop one gas, the millimeter, tranquilizer. Uh use Use, 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 drop, still not, um, what can we drop which we are not gonna use, we can use these two, now we can, okay, one needed, we got a heavy rival, let's go. Is it reloaded? Let's check that as well. Let's put that one on the one. And let's put... Where are they? Those over there. Nope, we can reload this one. Not sure, but I got a feeling we got some kind of... We will have some kind of zombie rush coming, so... I want to be prepared. Oh wow, mounted on top, nice. We're not gonna go through there. Oh wow, these security systems are getting interesting and annoying. Okay, this should do it. This should do it. Access there we go. Plasma capsules for the plasma gun, which we don't have. Okay, are you full? You are full. You are full. Everything is full here. Okay, let's hack this console. This is the reason why you got so many unlock kits, because you will need them. Access granted. There we go. Okay. We've done that. Still hearing a sound. Well, 
Well, this gun at least did its job, let's say that. Oh my god. Okay, this is good to know. I wonder. Can we activate a gun? And still be able to pass through. Can we set it to enemies? Will it shoot us? It won't. Okay, it won't shoot us. Then let's move through it and at least have some guard. Well, I guess we're going through the window. There. Right next I to I don't think you want to do that, Mr. Jensen. Disengage lockdown, and whatever demons this station contains are likely to come crashing out on us. Afraid to die, Darrow? Or just unwilling to face what you've done? Oh, I know what I've done, believe me. I take no pleasure in it. And yet you still did it. I did what had to be done. Why? Why had this to be done? Twenty years ago, I gave the world augmentation technology. I thought I was giving it a bright future. But instead, I gave it the means to destroy itself. No law, no UN regulation was going to fix that. People are dying out there. Hundreds of thousands of people driven to the brink of insanity because of you. I had to convince the world. Before today, people believed we should steal fire from the gods and redesign human nature. Human nature is the only thing we have that gives us a moral compass and the social skills we need to live in peace. Destroy it. And you destroy our very species. Don't paint yourself a savior in this. What you're doing is insane. Is it? When this is done, the Illuminati won't be able to control men and women like you as they had planned from the inside out. No one will be able to use the technology I invented to make others into beings they desire. Something we both know has happened already. You think you're Frankenstein? killing his own monster. Actually, Mr. Jensen, I prefer to think of myself as Daedalus, watching helplessly as his child crashes into the sea. Oh, wow. And there we have the beginning of the plot, I think, for I'm the next this. movie. Now. You can't. The signal is being generated from the broadcast center at the base of this facility. Banchea's security system has been programmed to protect it. And we'll kill you before you even get close. You designed that system, Darrow. You can tell me how to shut it down. But I won't. You think what I'm doing is extreme. You simply don't understand. For humanity to survive beyond this century, it must abandon ill-conceived notions about transcendence and embrace change. But for that to happen, the hard lesson must be learned. Blood must be shed. Uh, my god, there are please. I think your individual is hurting. Help me stop this, please. Doing is horrific. Can't force people to change. We have to do it on our own. It needs punishment. Uh, I'm going to critique. What you're doing is horrific. It has to stop. You can't force people to change. They have to do it on their own or they'll end up resenting you for it. And doing it like this? My god, Darrow, it's insane. It is not insane, Mr. Jensen. Tragic, yes. Unavoidable? No. Even as I listen to your words, I realize a cruel truth. No one else has the vision to see what I've seen, the will to do what I have done. Well, that's You're true. all too weak, judging but never acting. None of you have the moral courage to see this through to its conclusion. Well, so be it. Mm-hmm. Okay, appealing would maybe be better. Now it's better because of the uh, happens now. After today, whatever you will say will be dismissed from a mess of murderers. Yeah, that's true. 
Just trying to justify genocide. To see if there's anything in here. Really. You want us to see what you see? Fine. Our humanity is threatened because technology is messing with our minds. But how can we recognize this message when we're grieving over the people you forced us to leave behind? Friends and neighbors, people we care about. Is the image of their murders the vision you want us to have? I have shown humanity the price of its complacency. The price of pride and arrogance. If people don't have the wherewithal to put aside their emotions and recognize that, I don't give a damn what vision they see. Look at everything that has happened since this technology developed. Search your heart. You know as well as I do that humanity is on a downward spiral. Torn apart from within because people like you can't resist the temptation to play God with your own evolution. Can't you see why we must take the temptation away? I'm different than you. Still human beings. Step back just for a moment so you can see it through our eyes. People like me, you mean not like me? Your creation is leaving you behind. Evolving without you. Oh. Oh. Ouch! It's there, it's just a jealousy. I'm going to this. People like me? You mean not like you? You changed the world when you invented this technology, but your creation is leaving you behind. And as long as it's allowed to continue, mankind will use it to evolve without you. Until the father of tomorrow is known as yesterday's man. You think I am doing this for my ego? I never wanted this, any of it, but I had no choice. Once upon a time, I would have given all I had to be like you, but genetics cheated me of that chance, cursed me to become a cripple. And you know what? I'm relieved, because I look in your eyes and I see how disturbed you are by what you have become. Admit it, Mr. Jensen. You've done things with those enhancements of yours you would never have considered before. You know your humanity is ebbing away. That's not completely true, actually. Appeal, I hate it, you said it really for only thing that left. I got you covering it up with your patents and saving the world, trying to justify it. But deep inside, you're nothing more than an angry little child. And spiteful head to the over there. Now that this is over, nothing will be left but happy and fear, smoldering in the ashes of burning cities. How can anything be rebuilt from that? You can't have the future, so no one can, is that it? Open your eyes, Darrow. Look at what your obsession is doing to the world. When all of this is over, nothing will be left but anarchy and fear, smoldering in the ashes of burning cities. How can anything be rebuilt from that? Destruction is a necessary first step. Without destruction, there can be no reconstruction. No breaking free of the horrible road we have set ourselves on. If you cannot see that, then there's no use discussing this any further. Kill me if you wish, but I won't give you the security shutdown codes. I regret nothing I have done. The technology I created must be destroyed, and this is the only way I know to assure it. Go down there, Mr. Jensen. Go down to the core and see with your own eyes the horrors your precious future creates. I've made my choices. Now you must make yours. Hmm. That didn't go all true like I wanted it to. Put that away. Go. See for yourself the future this technology offers. I wonder if it will give you nightmares as it has me. Well, if I look at this, it already does. Sorry, but... No. Just no. Okay, we're going down. Richard, the lockdown's disengaged. I'm heading back to the hangar to see if those blast doors are open. Have you been able to raise anyone? I'm picking up several glimmers, but there's too much interference. I... I think you're... on your own, Jensen. Careful there, Francis. You almost sound like you regret that. Um, look at the radar. There's a lot downstairs. We are going to mess with it in the next episode. I hope.
hope you enjoyed this one. Please leave a like on it if you did. And I'll see you on another one. I'm going to stand here, sit down and cry.